Hey everybody, welcome back to Phantom Doctrine. We're going out on this uh, double disguise mission to Washington, D.C. We're taking out Rodats and Canasta, not even full health. We're going to try to do this as quietly as we can. Hopefully we can pull it off because uh, we're playing from behind now. But it's kind of, it's actually kind of fun, uh, in my opinion, to try and claw our way out of this. We'll see if we can. Uh, so let's rock and roll. Magic Orbit. An enemy operative is conducting reconnaissance in the area trying to locate our headquarters. Allowing them to continue would put our operations in jeopardy. Make sure the agent never reports back. If possible, capture the trespasser for interrogation. So we have to kill or capture, but I mean, with the situation that we're in, I don't know if that's gonna, if that's gonna work out well. Uh, I think we'll support from the west, but if we go from the east, we can also scout this hallway. Or, sorry, from the uh, north. We can also scout that hallway. So let's do that. And in terms of deployment, doesn't really matter because we're just going to get dropped inside. Also, let you guys know, and some of you guys already know this, but I'm going to be traveling from the uh, 17th to the 27th of August. I'll be out of town and. Lone. Enemy there will likely be this this will probably be the last capture. video for Keep about a quiet. week it maybe must. a little bit more than a week um, but then we'll pick it up when I return so hopefully you guys understand I'm going to see uh, the international Dota tournament if you don't know what that is I'm pretty pumped okay Rodats my man right outside the door what are we working with here two intel okay hold on Two intel, four loot. So we should try and find this as best we can. Uh, let's go inside here. here. Rodats. We've got some up here. Maybe we drop you down below? Or you can even turn this off. Oh, you can't yet. Okay, let's drop you down there. You can disable cameras. Oh, I see why. <laughs> Whoops. I read you. Okay. Whereabouts? Can I put you? I'll turn this off for now. And then let's try and find something. We saw it, but okay. So there's actually a case in there. Ah, it's upstairs. Okay. Oh, we have a third level, too. Jesus. This is crazy. I find it really difficult to spot the, um, the intel and stuff, but... Okay, how are we gonna get up to this floor? Over this way. Can I get this without being caught? Looks like it. Medium armor, thank you. Finding the equipment, I, <laughs> I want to say it f feels way more important than finding intel because you're like so strapped for equipment all the time that it feels like this is the most effective way of getting it done. Hit me. Okay. Do I want to send you up? I don't see anything on that bottom floor. This door is locked, but we could go around, technically. Since they don't care about us breaking windows. My skills are at your disposal. And then I'm thinking, we'll take a look inside. We'll do it right away. But, uh... It's probably better we just take him down and get out. SV-63. Let's scout this. Okay, so it's one guy, but still. Where's the evac gonna be at? We have one relatively close, actually. So we do the breach, and then we just leave. Me. I think that's probably the best plan.
I don't see anything in there. So we'll try and... St we'll start moving up top. And we can set Rodats up for the breach. But the rooftop is like super busy too. Uh, we can grab this. TKB. Okay. Yeah, like, see this guy? We can't even take down because Canasta is uh, not in the greatest scenario. Oh, what is going on in here? That I'm going to need to check out. It's crazy. I don't see intel anywhere. I don't see it at all. I'm going to I'm going to go th check this Standing side here. I don't know if they're going to appreciate us walking through there, although like we are in disguise. I just don't understand like I've never seen that. That's crazy. Okay, we have some gear over here. Maybe that's where we'll try and go. Cool. Hit me. Okay, so we'll grab this gear, then we'll set up I inside the room, the then we'll call the thing. Heavy armor. So we got all of the gear, but no intel. That's okay. We don't need to get greedy. Be happy with what we have. Considering the circumstances. How can I help? And just be cool. Oh, he's got he's got company. That's great. I'm sure we can clear them both out. But man, are we gonna have to just make a run for it? I trust this is important. <laughs> As if that's not sketchy. Uh, uniform or not, that's pretty good. Oh, I should have called evac there, so we should have done. Standing by for orders. Let's uh, get another look inside. If the... Yeah, see his buddy, I think, is going outside and inside here. So we kind of want to do it when he's inside so that we get that breach. I'm going to call for evac here. Extraction order. Let's open this. Yeah, see, there's his buddy. Okay, so if I set up a breach here... Could I target him? Yes. Okay, but we I want... I want my target more. lock... To be on this guy. And then he'll be, like, the extra. Because we need to output a whole bunch of damage here. So if I do this, this is going to take up a turn. Yeah, I think this is the go time. Mission target incapacitated. Copy team. Oh, we didn't get this guy. Are you serious? Oh, frick. I was worried about that. Okay. Man, we actually can cover quite a bit of ground though. I'm going to do it. This guy will get some, some damage in, likely. Or at least remove some awareness. And then we can maybe hop over to the other side of this van. Please, no. Please. Awareness gone. Well, not even that bad, actually. He might have another dodge in him. I hear somebody setting up an ambush. Reinforcements coming in hot. 
I didn't anticipate how much movement we'd have after the after the ambush, so something to keep in mind. Jeez, how many are there? I know there's a bunch on the roof. That kind of does worry me. I'm hoping we can get into this middle section. So that we're out of vision. And then what we'll do is we'll set up overwatches in this direction. Looking forward to it. And you can set one up in this direction. We just need to survive this turn. Wait, somebody say help? Oh no! Is that I wonder if that's this person. Or maybe I misheard. That'd be kinda cool if we could rescue those people that we find. I thought maybe that would be an intel thing, but like... I'm shocked that I can't find any classified documents. Oh, wait a sec. Oh, I didn't see this place. Guaranteed this is where it's gonna be. I didn't even see this other place. I thought that... I thought we'd hit the outer, uh... Barrier when I was searching. There's another... Oh! I guess that could be Intel then, too. Intel's always been represented by those files. So, like, here's... More stuff, but it looks like that would be loot to me, so... Huh. Weird. Either way... How can I help? We seem to have gotten out of here with relative safety. So, we're gone. Okay. We kind of needed that. It would have been nice to get intel, Stick but we did get a bunch of equipment, so... I'm pretty happy. As we try to throw a spanner to Beholder's works, the enemy's getting more and more interested in our little cabal. We've been getting strange messages. One of them really upset Fender, who started to act aloof and irritated. I think the paranoia of this whole situation might be getting to him. Okay. We had to torture old safe house in Beirut to go off the grid and follow the lead on a British submarine heading home after seizing sensitive conspiracy cargo. Beholder agents will be hard-pressed to get it back. We just need to beat them to it. Okay. Nice. Solid weapons, solid gear, heavy armor, very nice. Does inflict a mobility penalty, but so does medium armor, so, okay, cool. They are wounded, but they've, they've been wounded. Could be worse. Okay, so you guys, good luck. Um, I guess we're going to look to move our hideout still. Which really sucks. Big time. But it's what needs to be done. We still have this story mission. I'm kind of just holding that for a bit because we have to, we're kind of trying to recoup. We have people that are injured and like, it's kind of risky. So where do we want to move our hideout to? We have two options at 4,000. I guess we choose either one of these they're the same this would be nice but it's just not gonna happen so we're gonna move to let's move to Kuwait I was really convinced that that mission where we were like destroying all of our stuff <laughs> was gonna be us moving to a new place I was, I was, like, fully convinced that that was how that was gonna work, but... Oh, it, it, I like that it, like, changes the layout and stuff. That's cool. That's very cool. Okay, so now, Forger's still going. Our danger is down a bit. Let me see, is there anything in here? Uh, MK Ultra would be really nice. Tail Job would be really nice to reveal enemy cells. Yeah, we need that. We absolutely need that, because this active Beholder cell is kicking our ass right now. 
Uh, so 1200 bucks, we can get that. Agents lose heat faster. Like, there's so many really good upgrades in here right now. So many really good upgrades. Hmm. We'll see what we can do. This is this is going to take a while. Okay. Let's send a couple people out. All these exposed IDs is risky, I guess, but... That's the situation we're in. Okay. Let's see. Reveal enemy cells. Let's go. That's the job that comes up uh, here. Which would be really nice. We can try and interrupt this. I think that's probably the wisest decision. So if we get these really early and we have people close by, we can do it. I just don't know if this ID exposed is going to pose a problem. We'll soon find out. Alright. Cable's body ENG talent revealed. We're seeing that quite a bit, all this body engineering. That's something that we'll unlock from the workshop as well. Let's send them. And we revealed the surgeon. Not sure how to use these just yet. We've seen this a couple times. I guess this is where one of the enemy agents is. So, the other thing we could consider is when you know there's an enemy agent there, we could go and try and take them out so that'll slow them down a little bit. Um, I just don't think that we're that well equipped to do it at this exact moment, so... We'll try and interrupt where we can. Uh, what do we have here? Let's send these two? Just suspicious activity. Okay, very nice. Very nice. Unlocks the seek agent job, allowing to reveal known enemy agents activities. So I guess that's where that comes in. New identities are cheaper, increases the agent limit, MK Ultra. Oh, this, I think, I think a forger job just for the situation we're in is probably best. Formers more quickly, agents lose heat faster. Secret files faster, infirmary slots. Actually, that could be good for us right now too. Um, Stony. Okay, so Stony needs to come home. Stony and Haida need to come home. Uh, let's send Stony. And where is Haida right now? Where is he? What's he busy doing? Is he one of our guys that, like, pieced out? I don't think so. Hmm. Let's try and interrupt this, too. Mouthful agent. We're giving up some XP, but... Oh, hide is on this job. Okay, cool. Okay, HMS Conqueror will have arrived home by now. The recovered enemy cargo will now be moved to a secret location awaiting further processing. The enemy will attempt to recover the cargo as soon as possible. We must beat them to it or we'll lose all trace of this conspiracy. No pressure. Okay, enemy operation interrupted. Hostile assets withdrew to safety. Very good. Now let's bring... Let's bring uh, Haida back. Like, he's out there with <laughs> freaking one health, dude. You crazy? Go. Sending our agents all over the place. So, yeah. We're trading off safety for XP, but I think it could be a hell of a lot worse. 
Okay, so he's in. I should bring... I should bring him back. I think we're going to save for the additional forging spot, 2400. Money's our biggest issue right now. Okay. Let's send Kaz back home. We'll get him in the infirmary. It's doing okay. And then let's go forging. Then we'll want to go MK Ultra soon. I can't even scout that area right now. Okay, recon's done. Good job, guys. Rodat's killing it. Canasta, killing it. How are they doing? We need to... Hmm. I think this is okay for now. Go across the world. Oh, hold on. Informer reveals secrets after the delay. During that time, the enemy may attempt to assassinate them. You can launch Informer rescue missions to gain secrets and new recruits. We're just going to send Deadpan. Okay, so... We could do it if we had the tail agent thing. We need three agents here to do that. Um... Do we have the ability to get people there in time? We'd have to get them there in two hours. So Cable could go, but that would be it. So it looks like we're going to have to do uh, some recon. And he gets more experience from this, so that's good. And then it looks like we're going to do this assault. Okay, counterfeiting job is good. Who can I put in here? Stoney's almost healed. When he's when he's healed, we're gonna put him in the forger. But let's let him get fully healed up. Conspiracy plot. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna want to do this as well. We're gonna further their ultimate goal. Two enemy agents on site. It says four hours left. I think that's going to be about as good as we get. Okay. So let's set up our guys. Cannot use support. Tactical recon's not been completed. That's fair. Okay. So let's use... I'm just looking at heat here. Xerxes for sure. Uh, Stoney's... He's up there. Uh, but his heat is maxed out. So I have to send Canasta, and I have to send Rodats. The only other option is Haida, but both of these guys have heat, like, maxed out right now. So, until we can afford to replace them, it's not going to work. Which means we're going to go out with three, which is very intimidating. So what I'll do, I think we'll do something like Oh yeah, we can't use disguises here. So this is going to be a fight. This is going to be tough, too. This SV-63 sniper rifle, yes. That'll be cool. That'll be awesome. I don't think any of these guys have proficiencies in the SV-63. No. Okay. So I think you're set up fine. Rodats can be sniping. Also, let's give him... Hmm. Medium armor. Flashbang. And a lockpick? Hmm. 
Yeah, okay. And then Canasta. What do we want to do here? We have... Didn't we have that extra clip thing somewhere? Let's get rid of that from you. You can take it. Give you the heavy armor, so we'll keep you in front. 35 to 70 damage. It's pretty good, and the proficiency is nice. I'm just looking at what the other options are. Maybe a shotgun on the side. Take a first aid kit. I'm going to remove Kaz here. So Xerxes, Canasta, Rodats. Let's get rid of these. And I think if we can go med kits on everybody, that'd be nice. We also saw the power of the smoke, which was really cool. Um, maybe we'll forgo lockpicks for first aid with you. And then you can take the smoke here. But the frag grenades are nice too. It's a lot of damage. I don't know. I think I'm going to prioritize frag grenades. So medium armor, heavy armor, light armor. I think that's all right. It's going to be tough, and it's going to be openly hostile, but because we can't use... Um, because we can't use disguises, I feel like our only other option would be to silently be taking down people left, right, and center anyway, so maybe a firefight's our best option. I don't know. Maybe I'll... I don't know. Maybe we'll switch one to have the the bulletproof vest. It's still some damage reduction, but um, we could maybe get something done first and then make the job a bit easier. But anyways, Xerxes, Canasta, Rodats. Remember, as I said, uh, there will be a downtime in this probably just over a week. And uh, I'll keep you guys posted. I would also be open to the idea, like, our campaign's gone pretty... It's, it's interesting now because we're fighting from behind, which I think it's cool. Um, but if you guys think that it's going to be too difficult, uh, I'd be open to restarting a campaign as well. But I'm also looking at starting another XCOM campaign in like September-ish. So I don't know if we'd want to be doing both of these games at the same time. Just sharing my thoughts. You guys let me know. But uh, yeah. Anyways, I'll, I'll see you guys in a week-ish or so. And uh, hopefully you guys can be patient and we'll be back soon. Thanks so much for watching. Bye for now.